Guardian XO The Guardian XO full-body industrial exoskeleton robot was designed to increase human productivity while keeping them safe. A simple example. If a person starts lifting loads that are too heavy, he'll throw his back out. If you entrust his work to an ordinary robot, something may go wrong. The Guardian XO is the perfect combination of human and machine qualities. The manufacturer says the exoskeleton combines human intelligence with the power, endurance, and precision of machines. A person operating the Guardian XO can safely lift and manipulate objects weighing up to 200 pounds without fatigue or any tension. Unloading luggage at the airport? Easy. Pushing a cart with a heavy load? No problem. Replacing a wheel? No sweat. The robotic suit increases the strength of the operator by 20-fold, is powered by batteries that can be easily replaced even during operation. The Guardian XO can be donned and doffed unassisted in less than 30 seconds. Even Iron Man needed more time to suit up. It's believed that the Guardian XO will find application in a number of industries, from construction to aviation, from manufacturing to the Army, because even now there are similar exoskeletons currently developed by the military. These developments, by the way, inspired the costume designers and production designers of the film Edge of Tomorrow. Moreover, the exoskeletons on the actors are actually real with some CGI bits. Yes, this is almost what military developments look like. Bionic Boots If operating an entire exoskeleton to increase strength seems like overkill to you, you can use separate elements. For example, bionic boots. They're sometimes called jumping stilts or kangaroo shoes. That doesn't really matter because bionic boots could really become the footwear of the future. They help you move faster, and the way they work is very simple. The springs store energy in each stride and release you with longer stride length and better energy recoil. The bionic boots can be customized depending on what you want to do faster, jump or run. They're quite stable and can handle rocky or sandy terrain with no problem. These boots are also recommended for a variety of physical exercises. And yes, they are really cool. Unfortunately, it turned out that the world's not yet ready for bionic boots. For 30 years, Kihai Seymour was busy designing and building them. When he was 12, the future inventor saw a TV show about kangaroos and thought that people could jump like that too. Over the years, he's designed, built, and improved his bionic boots. He made them lighter, managed to accelerate to 25 miles per hour. Seymour got patents in 15 countries of the world and sent a huge number of emails to find investors. Alas, no one dared to take the risk. Yes, people wanted to buy the boots, but that wasn't enough. The most frustrating thing is that the media attention inspired a lot of knockoffs. A Korean company began selling the replicated shoes in several online stores, and a Chinese company even copied Seymour's design, mass-produced the boots, and even sold it under the original name on Amazon. Seymour simply didn't have the means to fight infringements. EXO-01 But enough about sad stuff, let's talk about another exoskeleton. Compared to the Guardian XO, this one certainly seems tiny and not very durable, but it has a slightly different purpose. EXO-01 is a passive exoskeleton, that is, it doesn't require a power source. It simply transfers the load from hands to hips through the supports and cables. Studies have shown that this can reduce the peak load on muscles and shoulders by up to 47%. It doesn't seem like a big deal, but when you have to reach for something above your shoulders or head, it's very exhausting. In addition, it causes serious damage to the musculoskeletal system in the shoulder area. By the way, it's one of the most common causes of disability in the construction industry. So exoskeletons like this are quite useful. Similar ones are used at Ford factories to reduce the wear and tear on their employees. They work in a similar way. A person performs many tasks with his arms raised above his head and gets very tired. The upper body exoskeleton supports the body, relieves excess tension, and improves health. Audi and Hyundai are also gradually introducing similar technologies. After all, the quality of the product will depend on the health of employees. And we're talking about world-famous brands. Most likely, such exoskeletons will soon be used in every field, or actually become a typical part of our lives. The Cryptide When it comes to cutting-edge concepts and designs, it's simply impossible not to mention something printed on a 3D printer. So here we go. A German designer and architect, Stefan Heinrich, has created a completely 3D printed shoe called the Cryptide. 
The shoe consists of an open design sole printed together with an upper shoe which resembles a sock. Moreover, if you wear this shoe, you'll leave traces like the cryptid would do. That's a mythical creature. Something between a Bigfoot and a Loch Ness Monster. But this all is not just about the way the shoes look. They're ultra ergonomic and incredibly comfortable to wear. At least that's what the creator says. The Cryptide is basically slippers and sci-fi movie shoes combined. But in general, the Cryptide shoes may well become the shoes of the future. Because many large companies use 3D printing technology today, Adidas, Nike, New Balance, and Under Armour use it to create sneakers, and it facilitates the entire production process. True, so far they only print shoe parts, but the progress doesn't stand still. Cray X But back to exoskeletons, the Cray X is a lightweight exoskeleton made from carbon fiber, yet it supports two areas of the body at once. The Cray X features a support capacity of 66 pounds, dust and water resistance, and its battery can be replaced right amidst operation. And since the exoskeleton supports two areas of the body, it reduces fatigue not only from manual labor and heavy lifting, but even from walking. Some even say the Cray X helps maintain proper posture. Rome. You know what else is important? Your knees. If you've been doing heavy physical activity, you know that sometimes it's the knees that fail you first. But don't worry, there's the Rome Robotic Exoskeleton and it'll help you ski longer. It consists of three parts, a backpack that provides power and data processing, and two identical parts of the exoskeleton strapped to the legs. They're designed to support the knees and quads. Sensors and an accompanying app allow you to adjust the amount of support the exoskeleton offers. The rest is pretty simple. Rome takes some of the load off our knees, allowing you to enjoy skiing or snowboarding for longer, making complex turns and recovering from injuries faster. Of course, this technology is also suitable for the warm season. e -knee. There's a similar device called the e -knee. This is, as its creators call it, an intelligent knee support. That is, it literally records what's happening to human knees and adjusts to it. For example, when the gyroscope detects powerful movement, the built-in chip will activate support. The knee support operates in three different modes that can be customized as well as the size of the support, and if necessary, the device can be charged through a wireless station or cable. Though you won't need it anytime soon because the e-knee works for up to 28 hours on a single charge. That is, if you run for an hour every day, one charge is enough for almost a month. That's convenient. Jet suit. Well, who needs all those exoskeletons and other things when you can just fly? The jet suit's been dubbed the Iron Man suit, even though it's fully 3D printed. The total capacity of all five engines is 1,050 horsepower, and they can accelerate their pilot up to 84 miles per hour. This is some incredible speed for such a device. No wonder it set a world record. Yes, the creator of the jet suit, together with his brainchild, is indeed mentioned in the Guinness World Records. First, he set a record by clocking 32 miles per hour and then exceeded this speed more than twofold. This happened in 2019, so perhaps the jet suit will fly even faster soon. In the meantime, anyone can try it. Just come to the training center and pay for the experience. Enco. Though it's not cheap, a flight will cost you at least $3,500. So let's go back to the ground to check other noteworthy and unusual devices, like Enco sneakers. Yes, there are plenty of shoes with shock-absorbing cushions, but what about actual shock absorbers? Yes, the ones with the springs. The way they work is quite simple. A person steps onto his heel, the shock absorber compresses, and then when he raises his foot, it expands again and pushes the foot up and forward. In addition, the shoes also help absorb potentially traumatic impact when the feet hit the ground. The spring tension can be customized to suit your needs, and as an extra bonus, the rubber studs on the bottom of the sole can be replaced if they wear down. Hip-only soft exosuit Well, if you think that this video has mentioned all possible types of exoskeletons, check out this soft exosuit. It weighs only 11 pounds, with much of the weight remaining close to the user's center of mass. This helps wear the exosuit without much tension, and the suit, in turn, reduces the rate of metabolic costs when walking and running by 9.3% and 4% respectively. Moreover, the suit also monitors how its owner moves, and automatically switches modes. Hydra Hand 
To run faster and longer, people come up with shoes with springs and exoskeletons, and in order to swim faster, they got webbed fingers. Hydra Hand is a very simple thing, something like fingerless gloves. They're made of highly elastic silicone and have a special hydrodynamic shape. But the most amazing thing is that these webbed fingers increase swimming speed by 23%. Well, and as a bonus, they provide a better grip on slippery surfaces. Quantum Stealth If you already learned to fly like a bird, swim like an otter, jump like a kangaroo, all that's left is to become invisible. Camouflage company Hyper Stealth has created Quantum Stealth, a material that renders an object completely invisible. It removes not only visual, infrared, and thermal properties, but also the shadow of the object. They claim the material is real and actually works, although people around the world have their doubts. Apparently, there's not enough evidence, but this material was developed for the military after all. Details about things like that are usually kept secret. And don't be afraid that in the near future there will be invisible machines or something like that. The creators of Quantum Stealth say it's difficult to promote the technology, and most of the military people they spoke to simply couldn't believe the material was real. Apparently, only a single copy of the Quantum Stealth material exists so far, and there's no guarantee it'll ever be available on the commercial market.